at least with three eyes, has stopped moving or so it would appear. The sighting occurred and scientists found it beyond explanation. A product that had been slicing through space in bright streaks, leaving a trail as it neared the sun, appeared to suddenly freeze against the field of stars. There was no movement. The shock was electric at first. What could cause something so dynamic and well-observed to simply stop moving? The images spread rapidly through observatories and space organizations, but there was nothing else, no further data, no explanation. The implications and the silence reverberated through our understanding of extraterrestrial phenomena. At first, astronomers had traced three atlas as an interstellar visitor, one of the few known to enter our solar neighborhood. It moved along a hyperbolic course, slipping past the sun's gravity and destined to depart once more. The comet showed clear activity, outgassing, a coma, and dust signs of a typical comet cutting across the heliosphere. Observers tracked its speed, the emissions it produced, and mapped its path. The brightness and spectral signature gave the impression of a relatively normal comet, though one that had originated far beyond our system bringing with it the secrets of alien formation regions. Then came the moment. Multiple telescopes recorded it no longer shifting its position relative to background stars. Subsequent exposures, instead of aligning with its predicted trajectory, showed three atlas locked in place. It seemed to have evolved into a stationary pinprick of light in the vast field no flicker, no motion. It endured long enough to defy statistical coincidence. Astronomers rushed to confirm, examining instruments, checking alignments, ruling out tracking or calibration errors. Every test came back normal. The effect persisted. It appeared that the comet had halted its drift across the universe. Scientists were shaken. In the universe, motion is essential to mechanics. An object on a hyperbolic path should accelerate as it falls deeper into the sun's gravity, then slow as it moves away. It cannot simply hover. Yet three Atlas appeared, for a time, to do exactly that. The repercussions were profound. Were we witnessing an artifact something non-natural? Were there forces or fields at play that we had never before encountered near the sun? Could internal mechanisms within the object be influencing its course? One possible explanation was a visual illusion caused by overlapping exposures. Perhaps each frame was slightly misaligned, or the comet's brightness so low that only the core was visible, presenting the illusion of stasis. Teams accounted for that possibility cross-checking against known stars, stacking images, and using diverse observational vantage points. The conclusion, the apparent stasis was not an artifact. Even when observers changed orientation or instruments rotated fields, the effect remained. A different line of reasoning involved forces other than gravity. Comets are known for unpredictable behavior jets of gas from uneven surfaces can create tiny thrusts that alter orbit slightly. For most comets in our system, such forces are well modeled. However, Atlas with its exotic composition and interstellar origin might behave differently. Outgassing from deeply buried volatiles could generate anisotropic thrusts strong enough to disrupt its expected motion. If a jet suddenly activated opposite to its direction of travel, it might nearly cancel its momentum and make it appear to stall. But that scenario strains credibility. First, the number of jets required to counter such motion would be enormous especially for an object moving at tens of kilometers per second. Second, the effect would need to persist precisely long enough and in just the right vector to maintain near-perfect stasis. Third, such outgassing would produce visible anomalies in the tail or spectral signatures none of which were observed. Yet another, more radical idea emerged, that 3 Atlas was more than a passive comet. It might be interacting with unknown fields or forces, perhaps magnetic structures within the solar wind's plasma, or even minute spacetime distortions anchoring it in place. Discussions drifted toward theoretical physics. Could dark matter or exotic interactions be at play? Might we be witnessing evidence of propulsion fields beyond human understanding? These ideas were speculative acknowledge, but unconfirmed. Still, the sheer mystery of the observed stasis compelled scientists to entertain them. Meanwhile, 
radio tracking continued. Numerous observatories waited in anticipation for motion to resume. Some systems recorded faint Doppler shifts, suggesting that the object was still moving slowly, subtly, and within the margin of error. Others saw no shift at all. The conflict only deepened the mystery. Teams poured over telemetry logs, rechecked beam alignment, cross-satellite timing, and synchronization stamps. Questions arose. Could relativistic or gravitational lensing be bending the light paths, creating the illusion of stillness? No definitive answer came. And so, the mystery of Atlas with three eyes endures a frozen wanderer defying motion and, with it, our understanding of the cosmos itself. At the same time, the nature of three Atlas itself became a focal point. Observations by infrared telescopes and spectral instruments had revealed a coma dominated by carbon dioxide with relatively modest levels of water and carbon monoxide. Its CO2 to H2O ratio is among the highest ever observed in a cometary body at that distance that suggests a volatile constitution unlike typical solar system comets possibly reflecting formation in colder more remote regions of its home system. Its chemical behavior, sensitivity to sunlight and internal temperature gradients all could plausibly produce exotic thermodynamic behavior under stress. 